the other, the, the two other things I want to show you right now is talking about file transfer and talking about how to do screen share. File transfer and screen share are great. When I first thought about it, I, I was just thinking like, you know, file, like just, I just transfer a file and that's it. Or I share my screen really quickly to go over something with my client. But what I like to think about these two things is I like to think about them together. That I'm going to transfer a file to my client and then we can go over that. And I'm, in terms of like clinical interventions, or if you're a medical doctor, or maybe like a nutritionist, or just depending on you know what what you're doing for your profession, but I think about like a nutritionist who created a meal plan and wants to go over that meal plan while also sending that meal plan to their client, or me as like a therapist, if I have a CBT handout, or if I have, um, and I'll show you here in a second, like an emotion wheel that I want my client to have, but also do a planned intervention with. This is a great combination to do it. So on the left-hand side, I'm going to click on file transfer. That's how I'm going to send my client a document. And this document is saved on my computer somewhere. Or you can you know, download it from the website, have your documents in a file on your, on your computer. And now I want to transfer that file to my client. So I'm going to click on file transfer. And then I'm going to find my file. And I'm going to drag it up into this little drop area. I'm going to drop it there. And um, it seems like nothing happens on my end, right? Nothing, it doesn't, like nothing works, but it says it's waiting for my client. So I'm gonna go to my client view and I'm gonna click download. So this is what your client will see when a file gets dropped to them. Then I'm gonna click download. And now I have that file. I can go back to my provider view and if, I, if it, it was successful, this, there's gonna be this green banner at the top. It says client number one accepted your file transfer. Good to go. So now my client has a file and now, I'm gonna add, now I can do screen share. When you click on screen share, you have a couple options. You can either share your screen or what I personally love to do is I like to request my client's screen. This empowers your client during the session to take control, to you know, be able to uh, you know, have some access and control for, for me, I also like to do this selfishly because it is, uh, you know, it engages my adolescent clients in a different way and, you know, make sure that they're, it also holds them a little bit accountable during their therapy session with me. Uh, you know, if they're chatting with their friends or playing video games or surfing the internet, uh, it does hold them a little bit accountable to really focus on, uh, you know, our session. So I, I'm going to request client one's screen by clicking request screen. Again, on my provider view, nothing, it doesn't look like anything happened, but if I go to my client views page, you can see that your client gets a request. So they get a request to share their screen. I'm gonna click share my screen. I'm gonna check the box for the screen I wanna share. And then if I go back to my provider view, I can now see the file that I transferred I transferred an emotion wheel to this client. And now my client has access to, you know, to the to this file, but also access for screen share and it empowers them to, you know, they get to move their mouse around and they get to like, we, you know, we can focus on whatever part of this we want to. But this is a great way, again, if you are sharing x-ray results and you want to go over an x-ray x -ray with, a, with a client or a patient, if you want to go over a nutrition plan, if you want to go over any kind of handout or uh, you know intervention or mindfulness activity whatever it may be that you are sending to your client you can also then share your screen or request a screen to go over that with your client i love this emotion wheel it's really really convenient um, it also has wonderful uh, you know variety um, this uh I'll, i'm just going to really quickly share with you we had some requests from our first presentation um, where i found this emotion wheel and so i just popped up on your screen there's a, there's a humansystems.co, their website um, has great emotion wheels and there's a, there's a needs wheel, there's a comfortable emotions wheel. Um, so this is my kind of go-to from my emotions wheel. So if, if you want that, that's great. If you want to get rid of that little, little pop-up, just click that close button in, in the bottom left-hand corner of your screen. You can close that out if you don't want, if you don't care about it. So that is file transfer with uh, with screen share to then do a planned intervention. So that I love that combination, file transfer, share your screen, or ask your client to share a screen, and then do a planned intervention.